have agreed. Uh, we'll see how their styles clash against each other. Yeah, let's just get things started. This uh, strategy does mean with the start at speedball that, uh, you know, the Philly Warhawk strategy of maybe uh, choosing that as the third uh, match will not work out, but uh, does give them the potential advantage here to start. Or it's going to be a really defining moment for Arctic Studios if they're able to take out the Warhawks here. And we may be starting with a practice round. We'll see soon enough how they uh, behave off the jump. Yeah, I think, I think uh, you know, with this park that we're seeing, maybe a practice <laughs> round, but... Yep. And there we go. So shotguns and pistols uh, as the first loadout. Going to be some aggressive play in round one. I imagine Manzel and Hulk will meet somewhere in the middle. Yeah. But Wombo being aggressive early as well. Yeah, Wombo making some moves this time around. Hulk does get taken out here. Manzel. Wombo looking to play a bit of defense now. Wombo now. does get a good shot off, and another one. Manzel gets taken out. Another good shot. Wombo needs one more, and what a hero play. Wombo with the clutch, 2v1 with the shotgun, using this cover to his advantage, ducking in and out, and catching him in midair with that pump action shotgun. Yeah. Some early Great shots. Quick shots, yeah, but nothing connecting really. A couple of stray shots, and a little bit more connecting now, but Manzel takes a big shotgun into the hole. Molotovs are going out. They're looking to flush Wombo into the direction they want, and it worked. It worked out, and Arctic ties it up here with a really good team play there. So 1-1. One, one. As close as we can be to start this off. <laughs> <laughs> All right. A little bit of a, a different start here. Jump in different sides. It is back to, to knives and vaulters, it seems. Hulk with two kills. Yeah. I think that Manzel, not that he didn't have the shotgun to use, didn't want to be as aggressive. Um, but Hulk just kept his strategy straight. He went right to the middle of the map, got up high, and picked them both off. Yeah, really great shooting there. And now let's see if that strategy plays out again with these with this loadout. Uh, Vibe now kind of taking it at a different position. And Vibe threw both of his throwing knives at the start there, which I wonder maybe just because of the map, he doesn't know a better opportunity to use them. Yeah. But now it's Wombo and Vibe in the 1v1. Yeah, Vibe being very patient there and then coming into play gets to tie things up here. This is looking to be what a very a competitive series. Yeah, this is this is great so far, and it's only a few rounds in. Now it's the Warhawks Kryptonite, the crossbow. Yes. Oh. Down goes Wombo. Man's out looking to push. Hulk taking shots, but moving forward anyway. Oh, does get taken out, and the lead for Arctic Studios here on Speedball. It's not something you see too often against the Warhawks on this map, but they are down 3-2. Yeah, we'll see another round of crossbows may give uh, Arctic Studios an advantage here. Vibe looking to be aggressive, using his equipment. Nice to shots down. there by Vibe. And that's a 4-2 lead here for Arctic Studios. Great showing for Arctic Studios. They might feel just as comfortable on this map as the Warhawks do. It's probably their own home turf as well. Yeah, absolutely. It certainly seems that way. Now on to SMGs and pistols. Another close range, fast-paced sort of loadout. Oh, three Wombo. shots there. Does take out Manzel. Wombo trying to connect there. Do you have an idea? Sorry. And then Vibe is taken out. 3 4. 
I liked Wumbo's idea at the start of that round, getting up high, getting an idea of where the enemy team was. And then from that point on, they kind of had a plan in place for how they could rush. Playing a bit more patient now, Wumbo. Yeah. Taken very low, and that's one on one again. Wow, knowing that cover can be shot through, it is penetrable. Wombo is just kind of laying down fire, aiming for the head, ending with the headshot, but yeah. able to apply damage either way. Yeah, really smart play there to tie things up here. Wombo. Oh, quick. Quick wow. kills there, and Arctic Studios take the lead in his match point in their favor. Historically, that's been Wombo's spot. He's gone up into that cover and has been able to, you know, beat teams time and again from that corner, but that time he gets taken out. And actually, Hulk just sitting in that corner. Hulk gets taken out first, and Wombo soon follows, and Arctic Studios take game one. And speedball! The speedball round is over! Statement! No more speedball for the rest of this best of five. How do you think Warhawks responds? Well, I guess we'll see their number two map after this. Yeah, uh, I mean, what other maps have we seen them really succeed in? They've been pretty good at King. Yeah. Um, could see King come out. Um, what else have we seen them really succeed in? I feel like Pine was not their stage. Yeah, I think... In the instance, we saw them against Hunting Grounds, where Hunting Grounds was more specialized to Pine as a map. Yeah. Um, so they did struggle there. I wouldn't be surprised if King is the move, but um, either way, they're going to have to make a decision on where they feel like they would have the best advantage when their number one map is gone. Yeah. We'll see. Maybe there's a sleeper map we haven't actually gotten to see yet. Maybe they were just uh, saying, you know, we'll take our chance in speed while we feel really good there, but we have a, another one that is waiting in the wings, so we'll see uh, what they decide to bring here uh, in this next round, what map they choose. Uh, but advantage here to Arctic. A uh, really, really important win there uh, into the Warhawk. They deliver a shot to the gut early to the defending champions, beating them on speedball. I, I mean, now that we're getting into the best of five and best of seven series, if, yeah. if they aren't like immediate sweeps, we might see some strange maps being pulled out towards the end. Yeah, and then how, that game was incredibly close. Definitely could have gone either way. If it continues, uh, I could see us even going to game five. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised either. And it looks like Stack is the next pick here. This, yeah, that, this was one that wasn't crossing my mind, but it makes sense. So now the Warhawks, let's see how they look to approach this map. We've seen some teams kind of approach this with one player sticking back in spawn, the other looking to cause a bit of havoc uh, by rushing. Uh, through one of you know either the left or the right side, so I'm trying to get us dizzy here through. to start. It's working. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, here we go. Manzel. Does the uh, uh, what is that movie? Uh, he's like he's, uh, Keanu Reeves shoots into the air. What movie is that uh, again? I don't know. Like screaming into the air. No. My Keanu. Is that Point Break? Is that Point Break? That, that, is that from Point Break? I feel like it is. It could be wrong. Someone in the chat will correct me. We'll, we'll stick with Point Break for now. Yeah. I believe it. <laughs> uh, first round gets started. Wumbo with a first kill. Vibe Five. Something here does take out one. I don't know if Vibe wins a cross map shootout with Wumbo, though. Yeah, it's going to be tough. Taken very low here. Just one shot will do it, and there it is. Warhawks going up one nothing here. Vibe was not sure where Wumbo was. He pushed up a bit, and Vibe thought he was still back in his spawn, so he caught him completely off guard there. I think that the Warhawks are taking that approach to this map like I was predicting with Hulk rushing and Wumbo staying back. It seems to be... Yeah. One of the ways teams enjoy playing on stack. Yeah, now now Vibe has to two v one again. Hulk is taken pretty low. 
but it is going to be a tough job for Vibe, who's low as well. One shot from being taken out has to deal with both opponents here with just one shot. Yeah, it definitely puts him in a tough position for a comeback. If the flag were to even spawn, if you were to have survived that onslaught just now, how like you would think it's almost impossible for him to rush up and capture it. So it, it's tough when Menzel gets taken out early. Yeah, absolutely. And, and great suppressive fire there by Hall to allow that uh, kill to come through. There it is again, with Manziel falling to Hulk in the middle of the map there. Now Wumbo falls to Vibe. Let's see what he can do with the shotgun. Trying to get an idea as to where he's at. Oh. Okay, let's get taken out. That's Tough a 3 0 lead for the Warhawks. It is, is a sleeper pick for them that we weren't aware of, you know, the, the long distance uh, allowing them to kind of use their game plan of, of all kind of going in. Uh, yeah, this this is working out quite well for him. And Hulk with some really good shots there. He's been doing great, rushing right into the middle of the map, picking his spot, and then... A little bit of a go. rough bounce there for Manziel, and uh, puts him in an awkward position to be taken out. 4-0 lead here for Warhawks after going down in speedball to Ar Arctic Studios. Now saying, you know, you might have beaten us at speedball, but we have another another map we feel good about. Yep. They might be taking him a bit more seriously now as well, even though Arctic Studios had advanced further and we're waiting for them in Losers Finals. Oh, and Manziel like, uh... gets taken out again here by Hulk. Very close fight there, but not enough. That's been the story of this round, is that match between Hulk and Manziel in the middle and, and Hulk coming out on top. Yeah, but Vibe here doing the hero play again, the first round for Ar Arctic Studios, taking advantage of the low health of Hulk and then and, and winning the 1v1. Um... That was a great play by Vibe. He's been creeping out of the spawn towards the end of these rounds, and that's been working a bit better for him than staying you know, a bit more defensive. Yeah. Well, going for those... Uh... Immediate plays. We'll see if Manziel is able to collapse on Hulk and do something here. Five gets Five. taken a little bit low, but manages to take out Hulk. Gets taken down himself, not able to connect too much with Wumbo. Wumbo is pretty low here, though. Gonna have to take out Manziel one on one with a little bit lower health. Can't take as many shots. Does have the advantage, but did not connect there and gave away his location. The He's able to secure the point from up here, and that'll do it! That's our first point secure! That's incredible, and from that from spot top. as well. Yeah! Because where could Manziel shoot him from? There's not too many angles that could catch him on top of that crate, and he was able to capture it from up there. That's map knowledge. They picked this map for a reason. <laughs> yeah, that was really, really well played there. Uh, taken low and, and then spotted out by the one shot, but uh, it just wasn't enough. Able to capture the point very quickly, and that'll be it. The Warhawks take game two. And game three, we'll see what Arctic Studios has in store. What map do you think they're comfortable with? What, what have they been successful on that they want to take down the Warhawks? We might see Pine come out. If they were aware of how the Warhawks lost earlier on Pine to Hunting yeah. Grounds, that could be a good pick now. Um, we, I mean, if this match keeps going on, we could see Isle 9 come into play. Uh, we had shipment very early on that we have not seen on a stream since. Uh, but yeah, that was crazy. I, I wonder how Arctic just bounces back in general from that. I, I think that losing by a capture, especially in that fashion, oh, yeah. that, that's that's a, a bit of mental warfare happening on the backside as well. Yeah, I don't know if uh, you know the Warhawks managed to sort of get the, the, the lowdown on their opponents here in Arctic because, you know, game one was so, so close, uh, you know, going to that final round, five to six. This one just seeming to be dominant for the Warhawks. And there we go. We are in Pine. Yep. They're hoping that maybe the Warhawks just aren't a fan of this map in general, and it wasn't just a hunting grounds strength. Uh, but we'll see if Arctic, they might have this map as a strength of their own. Yeah, absolutely. Going to be a big, big match here for them. They don't want to go down 2-1. The 2-1 lead is crucial here for this best of five. Really does help the situation. And here we go. Getting things started. I don't know if this is a practice round to start. Does appear with the, the straight charge <laughs> forward. But we are in a practice round. 
And, uh, yeah. A little bit of, uh, fun, you know, between, uh, rounds here. It's a solid draw to end this practice round. <laughs> and, uh, just the oh, thing. Oh, there you go. Whoever comes out on top after this series has to go and play Passion. It's like you almost forget that you have this <laughs> juggernaut waiting for the winner yeah, of this series. The juggernaut that's taken down both of these teams is just waiting. Hasn't lost a single, uh, you know, uh, match here yet. So we'll see if uh, this this will warm either of these teams up enough to be able to take out Passion in the next round. Now Lumbo playing pretty patiently. Hasn't really left his spawn area too too far. Yeah, taking a couple of big hits here. Manziel as well taking some hits. I wonder if Manziel will switch over to the shotgun. He oh, opts not good to. Good cross map shot, but not connecting. Vibe does take out Wombo though. And now Hulk at four health has to somehow manage this and, and not able to do it. Arctic Studios take the lead. One nothing. Manziel. Brought out the shotgun in the middle of the map. He seems to be more comfortable with that, whereas Vibe tends to stick to the pistol in this type of loadout. Mm -hmm. All right, Manziel moving in here. Does have some vision. Smoke coming out. Taking some wild shots, not really connecting too much. Gives him an opportunity does, to move up a bit. Does take out Hulk and Wumbo right at the same time that coordination there by the team map selection has been huge i think that yeah. for, for manzel in particular he's able to kind of play at his own pace on pine um and that loadout was nice for him too having the shotgun in his back pocket yeah now hulk taking things slow here just waiting for the right opportunity it's on does have some vision there yeah, it is unlike Hulk to, to just stay back, but trying out a different strategy here on Pine. Wombo took a bit of damage. He is hurt. Yeah, we're, we're getting to that capture point here soon. Manziel does have vision. Oh, Wombo gets Wombo. taken out. Hulk has to do something here. Or capturing. Yeah. Oh, it does stop the capture, but... There we go. Arctic Studio is able to capitalize again. 3-0 here. That was incredibly clutched by Manzel. Gosh, rushing in. That, that cap that flag gets captured in just a, a brief amount of seconds. So both teams are close to getting a capture, but Manzel ends up coming out on top. Yeah, the back and forth there. Oh, and Hulk is taken out quickly by Manzel. Really good shots. And 4-0 for Arctic Studios now making another statement here. This is going to be tough to come back from. There's so much momentum in Arctic's favor right now. The Warhawks now have a bit of a, a weapon switch, and we'll see if I the... I think this might be the Warhawks' kryptonite this map. It seems like every time we find ourselves on this map, they just struggle. It might be their kryptonite. Um, yeah, they struggled against hunting grounds. They must not play Hope this does get it. Yeah, Hope does get a kill here on Manzel, though, and they take their first round here. Uh, really important... See if they can continue it now that they've uh, maybe feel more comfortable with these uh, weapons that they have, at least this round. I feel like Hulk's mentality there was to just go full on rush since he has the shotgun as his secondary. Oh, Wombo takes a big hit there. Ivan Manzel making some good, good moves here on, on both of the, the teammates here on Warhawks. Both low. Vibe taken out, though. Wombo and Vibe both taken out. Hulk needs to, to find a really big shot on Manziel here. Huge health differential. Here comes the grenade from Manziel. There it oh, is. Oh, and now it's all is needed. A really well-placed grenade. Let's see that one more time here. Oh, wow. Very well done. Match all right, match point. point for Arctic Studios. This is sort of like what we were talking about. The person, the team that wins the first round, just getting a huge advantage here, um, able to, to find the, the maps that they're comfortable with in, in the third round. And uh, now the Warhawks, if they are not able to secure this, they did take out Vibe here to start, though. Yeah, Hulk uh, landed some nice shots from long range with this weapon here. 
he has an idea of where Manzel is. But Manzel's been great on this map all round. Yeah, Manzel is just making things slow. Does get taken out, though. The 2v1 is tough. You can't check all of your corners there. And uh, when you're... Oh, wow. Kind of just through the bush. Got a little bit of a peek on him and just... He caught the name tag, and yeah. we'll see if they can pull it off again. The same loadout. They seem to be doing well with that gun, but Hulk is taking shots. Grenades are yep, flying. I'm taking low. Wumbo also taking quite low here. Oh, Wumbo taken out here by Vibe. Now it's up to Hulk to try to survive this. And, uh, you know, both players up. Even though Vibe is pretty low, it's still the TV one. Arctic Studios might just wait this out for the objective. Yeah, absolutely. The kill. And there it goes. And Arctic Studios taking a 2 1 lead over Philly Warhawks. This next match could be it, this next game here. So when it comes to map choice, the yeah. Warhawks, they're on the brink of being eliminated. They have gone through speedball and stack. Mm -hmm. So two of their, you know, their top two maps are off the table. Um, yeah. what, what do you think we'll see next? It's a good question. You know, we haven't seen the Warhawks in a situation like this yet. Um, they have been favoring speedball, but can't bring that out again. We've already seen now uh, Pine, Speedball, and Stack, right? So another map that maybe they could benefit from, uh, you know, could be Docs potentially? Potentially. And honestly, they could go back to Speedball, if I'm correct. And what I know about how they set this up is if they won I on a previous think they map, have they to. Oh, yeah, they could go Speedball, yeah, if they had lost there, correct. Now, they would not be able to do stack for sure because they won that, but mm -hmm. um, speedball is an option. They just might not feel as comfortable there anymore. Looks like they're going with King. Good choice here for the Warhawks. All right, here we go in King. Let's see if Arctic is able to take advantage here. Philly Warhawks feel more comfortable with this stage. They were able to choose it themselves. So let's They've see. Starting off before. with pistol. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We'll get a quick uh practice round in. Yeah, pistols and uh Durant the threat along with the pistols, so strictly yep, pistols, fists and grenades. This is a pretty uh bare bones class they have running here with that silence pistol and then like a semtex grenade, so nothing too crazy. Wombo goes straight to that corner spot that he loves. Yeah, man. So making some moves here on the side. Hulk gets taken out, but so does Wombo. Or so does Vibe. Now Wombo trying to find a position here on Manzel. Manzel does get taken out, and that's a 1 0 lead to the Warhawks. Wombo stuck to that corner the entire time. He didn't have to move too far at all. Um, even through stuns and grenades coming his way. Uh, he was able to keep it going. Good job by Wumbo. Yeah, and here we go again. Back to another uh, one of these corners here. Does get taken out this time, though. Vibe is on to him. Vibe does like getting higher up on the map, and he knew where Wumbo would be. And, and one taken really corners. low, and 1-1 one, one here for Arctic Studios. Great job by both of these on Arctic Studios. Manzel finishing it off, and now moving on to a new class. We'll see what they're going with. All right. Molotovs are on yeah, this. Yeah, Manzel now is doing the uh, Wombo strat here. Yeah, Vibe going up top again. Pretty quiet. Just like it's right. Yeah. Oh. Both a little too soon there. Hulk gets taken low. Manzel taken low as well. There goes Wumbo. Oh, and Wumbo is taken out. Only Hulk remaining. Taking pretty low, and there we go. 2-1 to Arctic Studios. The pressure is on. The Philly Warhawks, they're on the 
the brink of being eliminated from this tournament, down 2-1 in the series, and down 2-1 in this game. Hulk is playing a bit passively. Oh, no, early oh, with a quick kill, and there we go. Getting a quick round there, tying it up here for Billy Warhawk. He lost that corner. He oh, was yeah. in corner to the <laughs> way around for him earlier. We'll see how Arctic Studios can respond, seemingly knowing where Wumbo will be. Yeah, Wumbo does take a hit. Oh, there goes. taken out there by Vibe. Great shots by Vibe, getting the headshot. But down he goes. Yeah, now Hulk, the Manzel here. Let's see, only... Only about 10 seconds left now until the capture point. There Arctic. we go. Arctic Studios. Manzel getting the, the, the drop here on Hulk. They're taking this round by round. They, they keep tying it up and then taking a one game lead. Nobody's really pulling away just yet. Yeah, it seems like every once in a while we, we see uh, one of the players get taken out pretty quickly and that happened again this round. Now Vibe has to do something to, to come back, but nope, tying it up once again. This is just neck and neck between the Warhawks and Arctic Studios here. Yeah, this map is dead even for these two teams. I think it's a matter of if Arctic Studios can get some early damage off the jump here, then it puts the Warhawks in a bad spot. But if they're still comfortable like they are now, the Warhawks tend to have the advantage for the round. Making Arctic Studios come to them. Yeah, Hulk getting taken low there. Had the drop, does take out Vibe. Good evasiveness from Hulk. Manziel now has to 2v1 here to take the lead in the rounds. The objective is on the way. Yeah, here we go, and making a run for it. Manziel goes for it, does take them out. And what a hero play! They both lined up and just made it easy! This is incredible! <laughs> the double kill right by the OJ! Oh, man! That's the best play I've seen all day. That, yeah, was, that huge, was a great shot. Huge win there for Mandel. And gets the lead for Arctic Studios in a really tough position there. 4-3. Mm -hmm. Lead for Arctic Studios. Yeah. Oh, gets taken out! Wumbo rushing, which is not something we see often from him. Yeah, it does. It taken out as well. Just gets flanked. Now match point for Arctic Studios to take it and move on to the grand finals. On the map pick from Warhawks, they have not been having too much luck on their own picks. Yeah, you know, it's been pretty close on most of their picks. They had one dominant performance and then just struggling the rest of the time. Wumbo gets taken low, but is able to return fire and vibe. That was a bold move by Wumbo to stay up there and keep firing, but it paid off. Yeah, risky and all here for the victory. Hulk, there we go, making a it 4-5, still match point, but the Warhawks going to make a comeback. They're not done yet. This has been great to watch. This is so close. Interesting move to stack on the same side. Hulk taking some damage. Down he goes. It all comes down to right, Wumbo. Yeah. This is a big, big moment here for Wumbo. Very important. This is for a huge uh, a tripling of the, the prize pool potential. The objective will be live soon. Yeah, Wumbo taking a really good position here. Is he going to secure it fast enough? Oh, very close, but they're able to get there. Arctic Studios taking down the Warhawk. It's so Manziel. close, a fraction of a second there. Manzel was close.